Today, Colin Strickland, the third part of that triangle, took the stand. Alex, what did he say? Yeah, in fact, he's still on the stand right now. It is probably the most gripping testimony of all of the witnesses that we've heard thus far, just because he is such an integral part of this story, of this alleged love triangle. Uh, he is having difficulty right now speaking and mem remembering the uh, the events that happened on May 11, 2022, uh, the night that Mo Wilson's body uh, was actually found murdered in her friend's apartment. Obviously, this is a very traumatic moment for him to try to recall in front of a very packed courthouse. Uh, if I'll just can provide you a little bit of color, Elizabeth, he is keeping his eyes closed and his hands uh, directly in front of him as if he's just trying to pull out every little inch of memory that he has of that night. Uh, but he's speaking very quietly, very solemnly. You can tell that he's very pained as he tries to remember uh, the events of that night. In the meantime, Caitlin Armstrong, the defendant, sitting right there at the defense table, keeping her eyes trained straight ahead, not really showing much emotion today. But of course, the jury and every single person in that courtroom hanging on to every word that Colin is saying.